Hey guys, how's it going? Nick is here as always, and today I want to make a quick little tutorial for you um, to basically answer a question that I got recently, which is how can you choose to have one receiving Amazon warehouse instead of three? It's very quite simple, um, there, but there are a couple of things you need to know before you choose that option. Number one is if you choose one warehouse instead of three different ones which are assigned to you by default, you will be charged about 30 cents, I believe, per unit. Um, or 40 cents if it's overweight. I'll include the chart uh, right here. With that said, uh, I think it's still worth it, especially if you're only just starting out and you're getting a few items. It saves you on a heck lot of a headache and you have to calculate uh, the prices if it's worth it for you to pay freight forwarder to truck it to three different locations or to even fly it to deliver it to the three different locations or to pay 30 cents per unit. For me, even though the 30 cents per unit fee is more, I would still probably go with that just to kind of save myself a headache and you know add an extra piece, uh, an extra moving piece where I have to basically divide my ship into three and then send it to all these warehouses. It's just so much, so much extra work unnecessarily. So without further ado, here it is. Okay, so to change the option, it's pretty much three clicks away, three to four clicks away from us getting done. So you're going to go to settings, uh, fulfilled by Amazon. You're going to have where the inbound settings, you're going to click edit. And then you have this inventory placement option. This is the default section. This is the one that basically tells Amazon, hey, I want you, Amazon, to assign three different warehouses for me and divide my stuff into three different uh, you know, valuations and then tell me which warehouses that you want me to deliver to. But then if we change it to inventory placement service, which is the one that I chose, is that it basically tells you one warehouse where you send all of your goodies to. You would just click this and then you click update and then everything is completed and that's it. It's as easy as that. Simple.